Hello everybody, it's Dave and Esper and we are going to be unboxing brand new peripherals. Yes! We're excited. Bye! Aegis, Shield of Zeus, mouse pad, however you say that. Um, so <laughs> this one comes in two different sizes. It comes in the extra large and the large. The one we have is the 440 millimeter by 370 millimeter, which is the extra large. And then the second version comes in a 300 millimeter by 360. So thankfully they have all this information on the box or we'd be screwed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so look at that bad boy. So the texture on this is actually really, really soft and it has these nice embroidered edges around here. Very, It's a stitching edging. It'll be good to catch all those crumbs when you're eating while playing at the uh, same time. So what they say on the box here, because I'm going to read it, is that it is a new 3D fabric, high density texture surface for ultra smooth gliding. And it is actually really soft. It's very soft. Anti-slip design with a rubbery base, so the base oh. is a rubbery, so it's not going to move around. Slip. And uh, it's it's a really soft material. Mm -hmm. I like how they have the um, the little caricature they have for their brand for Tessero on the on the pad too. It's like a really subtle shift too, so it's not like super like oh my gosh, this is the product I'm using, but it's it's just enough that you know exactly what you're using, and it, it feels really good. All right, so the next product on our list of epicness is the Shrike Laser Gaming Mouse. This is the black edition, and this has up to 5,600 DPI adjustable setting. And I like how for Tessero, all of their products are like named after things. But here, do you wanna do, you wanna do the boxing while I read things off the box? Ooh. Ooh. Ah, ah. God, so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Can I, can I open it? Yeah, open it. Oh, oh actually, it looks pretty sweet. Ooh. Oh, those, those are the weights. Okay, so that's pretty important, I think, for any mouse user um, having adjustable weights. So they have little ground out weights, which is pretty cool. And you can actually, I can bench these. Do you lift, bro? Yeah. Do you do lift? You lift? Do you I do now. Pull 10 grams. Yeah. <laughs> and so let's see here. So it has five mappings with 40 macros, 128 onboard memory, up to 1,000. Pulling rate, 5600 DPI, eight programmable buttons, that's a, that's hella buttons. And then it's also a full color LED illumination. It's pretty sweet, so you would just have to download the program that they have on their website and you'd be able to get started on changing stuff up on the mouse. And it's one of these really nice tangle-free cables. It's like the fabric-y cable, so it won't get all wrapped up and bent up. So the cats will probably really enjoy uh, attacking. Yeah. attacking. <laughs> so uh, this keyboard in particular, the Lobera, hopefully we're saying that right, knock on wood, um, is the blue switches. This is one of the first full-color illumination mechanical keyboards. They say it on their websites, which is really cool. So you can actually download a program and completely light everything up on here. You can see it on the back of the box, there's like a little sample. So you can like set up a quite quite a variety, I think, of, of colors, which is pretty cool. And then I know you brought up the blue switches. So, yep, those are very tactile and loud. So if you like tactile and loud switches, those are the ones for you. But this also comes in. Oh, you have blue, brown, black, and red for this keyboard type that you can purchase yourself. So depending on your personal preference, you can certainly customize it for what you need. So if you're not into blues and you're not into like super tactile, like lots of noises, I would suggest either the uh, black or red switches. Or if you want something similar, not as loud, you can go with the brown switches. It also has a really cool cable, the, the cloth-like cable so it doesn't get tangled. It has a longer wear life and I know that sounds super nerdy but cables is one of my most important things because you have them everywhere. So on the top here we actually have extra USB ports as well as a headphone and microphone jack. So if you don't want to plug it into your computer or you need extra ports you can certainly plug them in right at the top here which I find really cool. We hope you guys enjoyed this little unboxing of these really awesome Tessera products. We know the company is still pretty young. They've only been around since 2011. And I mean, their stuff seems like it's pretty cool so far and I know I am excited to try it out. Anyways, we would like to give a big thanks to Tessero for this 
awesome gaming gear. So you guys can follow Tessero at Tessero Gaming on Twitter and Facebook. And then if you want to buy their products, you can go to TesseroGamingUSA.com. Information below in the description box. Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you, Tessero. Can we? Can we? Can we?